Welcome back, YouTube. I've had some more people uh, send me messages wanting to know exactly how the case feeder on the Dillon works, as opposed to the Hornaday. If you look in here, there's a little adapter plate with a groove in it that comes caliber specific. So when you order this is for the 40, it's the purple one, and it came with that plate. So I'm going to try to do this one-handed while I'm holding the camera, show you how quick this particular model works. I mean, it's smooth as silk. I'll try that one more time here. Okay, I hope you saw that. What it is, is when the, when the case is down in here, there's a, I don't know if I can shove it in, no, I can't do it. There's a block that activates, it's run by a uh, piece of steel cut on an angle, which in turn shoves that case out in there. I've never had any issues with this whatsoever, other than on the 40 either have a 9 millimeter inside this case or a 10 millimeter case and it's too high and when it comes through it gets stuck right there on the bottom of that purple and it'll kick the bottom out and leave the top it'll put it out on an angle that's the only issues I've ever had with that so if you make sure you're running the right case through there you shouldn't have any problem whatsoever this is my opinion the best case feeder system on the market today some may agree some may disagree but uh, I've used all different types of reloaders reloading equipment and this is by far the most flawless so anyhow I just wanted to put this out real quick a couple people had asked about it and wanted to see exactly how it worked from the inside as always, thanks for watching.